Welcome to Building PDF Forms. My name is Jim Healy and I'm the founder and CEO of FormRatter Inc. There are two types of PDF forms. One is called an acro form and the other is called a designer form. An acro form is a form that's built in Adobe Acrobat Professional. A designer form is built in a tool called Adobe Designer. This presentation will focus on acro forms created using Adobe Acrobat Professional. PDF forms have some unique strengths. First of all, there's broad user access. Over 1 billion people have downloaded the free Adobe Reader. Secondly, Adobe PDF provides pixel perfect printing. What this means is that when somebody prints out a form, if they need to print out your form, it's going to be pixel perfect. It's going to render exactly the way you intended it to. This is ideal for forms that have legal um, ramifications to how they look graphically. PDF forms support field formatting without programming. And Adobe Acrobat Professional, when you lay fields down onto your PDF, you can get those fields to look exactly the way you want. And you can format them with colors and set the field types without programming. This is a great feature. It makes PDF Forms an excellent tool for the beginner. PDF Forms support password protection. If you need to put a password on your form, you can set a password so that only people who you want can open them. PDFs support multimedia. This means that you can have attachments, audio and video, and flash inside your forms to enrich the form experience. Now, if somebody has Adobe Acrobat Standard, they can open up a PDF form and they can save it locally with the data in it to the desktop. If they have the free Adobe Reader, they're not going to be able to do that. But there's something called reader extensions, and this is something that FormRatter can offer. And what this does is it turns on a switch in the PDF document so that when the document hits the free Adobe Reader, someone can do local saving of the PDF form with the data in it. And finally, PDFs can support digital signatures. If somebody has Adobe Acrobat, or if the form has been reader extended, you can use a digital signature or a digital signature pad. That's a pad very similar to the kind of pads you see when you go into a retail store. And you can digitally sign the document. And that digital signature is legally binding. The recommended software to create PDF forms is Adobe Acrobat Professional. It can't be Adobe Acrobat Standard because it doesn't allow you to create form fields. It must be Adobe Acrobat Professional. We recommend using version 6.0 or above. The main reason we recommend 6.0 is for backwards compatibility.